Hi, it's good to be here. Hey, it's nice Hi. to meet you, Lizzie. Hi, Lizzie. I, I think I got to ask, sort of, you're coming into an experiment that's already been done before, like we've already seen sort of what this is sort of looks like. How is it as an actor to sort of go into this situation others have already been? Lizzie, I'm sorry, I'm going to... And then the characters don't know, obviously. You so sorry, Lizzie. I've seen the first season being put into sort of the same situation. Yeah. Lizzie, yes. I'm sorry, I'm going to have you repeat your question. I did turn your camera off just because it's affecting with your audio and it's uh, having a little bit of a lag. So if you want to just keep the camera off to ensure that your audio is on time. Okay, no, no problem. Um, I'll ask it again. It's sort of, you're coming into an experiment that has already been done before. Like as an actor, how is it to come into this knowing, hey, this other group already went through in season one? Yeah, I think that... Uh the girls did such an incredible job of portraying this this show in the first season and really giving us the tone and the idea of this world that these characters live in. And I think for us boys, it's our our responsibility to come in and kind of take that and run with it and 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 honor what they have done and hopefully add a new element and a new perspective and all in pursuit of, of giving this audience a great show and, and kind of a diverse uh, area of topics and, and, and characters. Yeah, it was a bit yeah. nerve wracking, I would say, coming into that you know, already established world and, and following such a wonderful group of, you know, of the girls in the first season. And um, yeah, it was, it was a cool time. Um, I, I gotta ask the question because it, it's the first thing I think when I look at a show like that is would you survive being thrown in a desert island, an island like that? Because I feel like I wouldn't. So who would you? I would not. No, I would no. be uh, not. I would be dead. Yeah. I, ironically, my mother's called me a mushroom for the majority of my life because I'm not a huge outdoorsy person. So when I got this show, it was a real twist. <laughs> You'll be spending six months in, on an island in Australia. Um, is there someone from the cast who you'd be like, they'd survive. So if I had to pick someone, I would definitely want to be on a desert island with this person. Mm. Like the actor. Like the actor, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was no like going through, I was yeah. going to the Rolodex I was like I don't know if any of us really stand a chance I think Zach no, would, would keep the talks going but I think it, it wouldn't uh it wouldn't help in the survival aspect of it um as for your characters going into season two is there like if what are fans looking have to look forward to or what do fans have to worry about because fans love to be like this is a character to watch out for are your characters the one to watch out for? Or are you going to turn on each other and be like, who should they be watching out for from the two of you or in general? I think in general, it's a good, especially with this show, that the ones you think you know, you maybe don't. And the ones you don't really know, maybe you do. And I think the only way to really find out about that is to tune in on May 6th. Tune in on May 6th and you'll get your answer. <laughs> Uh, that's a that's a very good answer. Okay, so perhaps the last one. Do you have a specific moment, both of you, that you're like, I'm really looking forward to people seeing this scene or this episode in particular from season two? There's a scene uh, in. Uh, th there's a scene in episode three that I really enjoyed doing with Alex. Um, that I'm really excited to see. Um. I really love um, episode two in the bunker. And that's all I will say. <laughs> uh, I am um, like, I don't want to take more of your time. I know you got a, a busy day. So just thank you so much for answering my questions and good luck with the rest of your interviews. Thank you. Thank Lizzie. you so much, Lizzie. Bye. <laughs>